Is this, was this game fool's gold? A little bit coop. How difficult is it? I mean, LeBron missed 26 of the last 28 games. AD's missed a ton of games. How difficult is it for these guys to just pick it up and, and you know, have that chemistry together? Even though, does it translate season over season? Or is it one of those things, once you get in a season, there's sort of a new chemistry that you have to develop with guys? Well, I think the chemistry has been developed. It only gets better when everybody is together and playing, rolling into the playoffs. It gets disrupted. I think the chemistry is still there, but it gets disrupted when a vital piece is missing, or in this case, LeBron's missing and AD's missing. I think, and I don't think this was full goals. I think this was meant to be. I think the Lakers need these games here. This is a great game where I think they got all the tools going now. Uh, yes, I think this was important because had they got into the playoffs, you got, what, two or three days off? Well, Lakers don't need any more days like that. They need these guys playing. You can't get in practice what you get in the game. Uh, yeah, the camaraderie's there, the togetherness, the, the uh, chemistry starts sealing itself, but they need on-court time action. You're not going to play LeBron in practice. Y'all go full court and practice. No, you don't want to get hurt there. So I thought this was important for the Lakers to get this type of game because you can see the chemistry coming back. And I think if they keep this, uh, Charles Barkley said the other day on TNT, he goes, this was a must-win game for the Lakers because the Lakers would rather see Phoenix than Utah. Yeah. And I have to agree with them. I think the Utah game is going to be a difficult, would have been a difficult game for the Lakers because you got a team that's rolling. And, and again, to me, yes, home court advantage plays a little bit, but if you're going to win a championship, and Pat Riley used to tell us this all the time, championship to one on the road. You're going to have to go on the road and split one. So, I, but in that case, I would rather play Phoenix because I think Utah is, is, is uh, they have their nose to what it takes to win a championship. The only two teams in the West that truly, truly, truly understand how to win a championship that's in the playoffs. Clippers. Are, are the, uh, no, not even Clippers, are the Lakers and Golden State. Those are the only two teams that really know how to win a championship. You don't think the Clippers do with Kawhi? Now, if the Clippers knew how to win a championship, they wouldn't have got beat by Denver 3-1, up 3-1 last year. They don't have it. They're trying to learn it and they're trying to get it together themselves. So I think those are the two teams. So uh, Phoenix is going to be a good test for the Lakers, but it'll be a test to where they can really get their game going. 